if we animate one object like this the path of the movement can be seen in trajectory on off and now we can only see the trajectory we cannot change it we can turn off the trajectory and edit key and now we can also edit keys also in order to have easier uh, curve animation we can use curve editor the difference of curve editor in 3d studio and 3d cut out is that the filters to show the different tracks are selective and they are in the simplest way one can use so the redundant tracks or uh, complicated ones that you don't really want to see here then you don't have them for instance if you want to change the animate of an object animation of an object like rotation this this time here instantly you will see the curve related to the curves related to animation will be added here and if you animate the movement you will see position will be added there so it will be much much easier for the animators not to choose irrelevant filters if in the animation we have plenty of controllers which are going to be selected all together like these three we always select them together we can create a selector for that this selector is an object which can be placed anywhere and change the size color and be linked to anything the property of this selector is if that if we hold control and click on that these three objects will be selected now for instance if we want to make a selector for these four objects and if every time we press and hold control and select that these four objects will be selected together color correction is to modify the color for instance suppose that we want to change the color of this part of the body the settings for this color correction we can get them all here in this box like saturation brightness and contrast and also color changing can be animated like if we choose the keyframe accordingly we can have this color change in in animation also we can apply this color correction in different parts of the characters or we can also apply it to the whole character so depending on different colors the color correction can make different colors sometimes we want to animate the visibility for instance if we have a cloud here which is going to move from here and we want to change the visibility from 100% to 0 during the movement but we cannot see the visibility but if we render then we can see the change in order to add sound to the scene we can click on edit sound here we have many settings for sound if you want to just add the sound then we can click on add and go on sometimes once we load a sound and play on that we might not hear the sound and if we click on sound toggle we can activate the sound play during the design by default in character rig some of the parts in some of the axes are locked so we cannot rotate or move them for instance this object in this in this axis is locked and can't be rotated then we can just remove the tick and then rotate it in the other axis too also for position and the scale if we decide to link an object to the other object then we can use link constraint like the animation is so that the character comes to the center and we want to link this object to his hands we select the main shape of the object and click link and click on the hand of the character this preview shows that in frame 0 this character 
is linked to this part of the object. Now in this frame we press add link and link it to the hand of the second character. So in frame 30 the object is linked to the right hand of the second character. But you should be careful wherever the linked is changed from one object to the other object. We should definitely set key for this character and then start to animate. In order to animate the switch we just need to select the text for the switch. Then we immediately see the previews we have created during the character generation. If we click on any of them in the desired frame then a keyframe will be added for this controller. It instantly changes in one frame. And if we want to, for instance, animate the mouth switches, then we choose mouth controller. So you can see that the previews are changing based, based on our selection. Also for this character, Depending on the character, the switch is different. And it's not really limited to characters, it can also be for objects.